So let's close out with talking about the way that we plan to publish the incremental releases of Trace Matcher in the future. We have switched to a rapid software development technique called Scrum, and Scrum uses something called a sprint. A sprint really is just a, a short development cycle where we work on the code and then produce what effectively is an MSI at the end of the sprint. Until now, those MSIs have been used internally to test the code. But the code is becoming quite robust and we're sure that you want to get your hands on the latest version of Trace Matcher as soon as possible. So what we've decided is that we are going to finish the sprint. There's then going to be a very basic level of testing to make sure that we haven't done anything stupid and it doesn't just crash straight out of the box. And then we'll be publishing each sprint onto the Tribe Lab site. That means that you have the choice. You don't have to, obviously, you don't have to install a new MSI every time a sprint comes out. But if you want to get the latest and greatest version of Trace Matcher, it'll be right there on the site and you'll be seeing the code perhaps a few days after we've actually seen it. So I hope you find that useful. And uh, of course, what we're, what we're looking for is your feedback. We want to know what do you like, what don't you like, have you found any bugs, and you can do that all through the uh, appropriate support forum in Tribe Lab. So on the subject of getting your hands on Trace Matcher, this is how you do it. I'm sure you're familiar with this by now if you've seen any of my previous videos. Um, you need to head over to community.tribelab.com or you can just go to tribelab.com and follow the uh, sign-in link to get you into the community. And right there you'll find a section on Trace Matcher. You'll see this heading, Tribe Lab Trace Matcher. Just click on the heading, that will take you straight in. You'll have access to the software, you'll have access to the user manual, and you'll have access to the support forum. And we've even placed some example traces on there for you to use to check out the features of Trace Matcher. And in fact, those, the uh, extreme matching pair of client and server. Pack, uh, packet captures that I used in the uh, demonstration earlier. I'll be putting those up on the Tribe Lab site. Okay, well, thanks for your time and I look forward to speaking to you soon.